tell Cersei. I want her to know it was me. Hello and welcome back to another episode of our Tyrell campaign. Uh, right here, we just took Loras Tyrell, the Knight of Flowers, Edward marching him onto Duskendale. And, and we're going to have him engage this force here. That was no fight. Numbers are about even, but we have a much more elite army than they do. So let's go ahead and play this Honor out. And glory await England men. All right, let's go ahead and start the deployment. We only have one unit of archers here. So let's go ahead and have our guards hold here. Actually, we'll have the spearmen just hold up in the front. Go ahead and have the First, let's go ahead and put these guys in the front with the stakes. Go ahead and follow Mr. White's advice and disable skirmish mode. Now we have... Let's go ahead and have all our siege equipment on fire at will mode. And we have a whole bunch of cav, so we'll go ahead and put Sir Dolores over here. This army is has a crap ton of cav, so we're going to definitely implement them in this battle. Let's go the ahead and start it. In reinforcements. Let's go ahead and use our massive cav numbers. We can go ahead and swamp this entire army before their reinforcements even get onto the field. Let's go ahead and have everybody charge here. Same thing over here. Go ahead and have our siege equipment stop firing for the moment. Go ahead and have the cap charge in the flanks now. Forward. Forward. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Yeah, these guys aren't even going to know what to do. General has no this entire army he is about to break. And abandons his... By St. George, we've captured the enemy's general. That'll take only him. half the enemy force remains. There we go. The this entire army field. broke. Let's you and run them down. Slaughter them all before the reinforcing army can get here. You could have sworn I was playing Rohan with the amount of cavalry that I brought. Okay, go ahead and have the rest of our men line back up on the hill. We'll bring them all the way back here. That's a whole lot of uh, House Joffrey corpses that we left real quick. Go 
And they're going to keep pushing up this force. Got, looks like two units of bowmen, some cav. Uh, four units of bowmen. Some halberds, two units of spears. Very little amount of knights. Uh, two units of knights. Go ahead and bring a third unit over there. Go ahead, have them run. We need them to get back into position before the enemy army's already over that hill. And we'll go ahead and turn the siege equipment back on the fire at will. I'll have them line up there. And now we'll have this other... What are these guys doing? Put these guys back in the tree line. I have these reach cav just take their time. Enemy army is not anywhere even near us yet. And then once again they're sending up all of their archers first, which is not the smartest idea considering look what just happened to this first army here. Let's go ahead and watch our lines. Our entire front line is stacked with elite House Tyrell guards. Anything that charges them is not breaking through. All right, let's go ahead and w let's start setting these guys up. Send that. Think the three units of cav should be enough. We'll have them hold their fire for now. Here come the cav on multiple fronts. There we go, we're just cutting through all of them. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Excellent. We're breaking all of them. We even got the halberds to turn tail and run now. Let's go ahead and cut off this last army. We have them shaking already. They're on the run. Okay, let's go ahead and pull the men back. There we go, we just completely wiped out three units of missile missile bowmen right there. Without even breaking a sweat, have them pulled back. There's two bowmen left. Let's go ahead and take care of them real quick. Okay, now that your jets start walking back. And we've barely taken any casualties so far. And half this army's already... It seems like they're running. We cannot let them do that. Alright, let's go ahead and charge the cav. Seems like they're trying to retreat off the map now. That's just simply something that we can't let happen. Have them pursue and run them down. And if they do decide to turn back, 
we'll pull the cav back, but it doesn't seem like it. They're committing to the withdrawal right here. Let's give them one last parting gift before they leave. Nice charge right in the back. We broke him. All right, pull them back. We've got the halberds here. Go ahead, s spread these cav out a bit. Keep this unit of cav going straight forward. Go ahead, charge them. All the units charge. We definitely don't want to let them get off the field here. Right into the halberds. Oh jeez, we broke them. No, we're continuing this. Kill every last one of these. We're not letting them escape. Just this is what you could do with superior numbers of cav. You got three units of spearmen got away, but that's all right. We're sending a message here. That was an absolute massacre. This is a clear victory that goes to only men of great virtue and valor. Who needs bowmen when you have a shit ton of cavalry? Look at that, we lost only 28 cavalry. And we literally sliced this army into pieces. That's what we like to see. Hopefully Lord Tywin took note of this. He'll think twice before attacking on, before attacking our house. An honorable, glorious victory. We have a temporary peace with him, but Where is it written that I have nothing to say to you, your will, sir. I would ask you to find it in your heart. Was that your honor. best shot? Your grace. As you command, my liege. Laying siege, noble sire. Go ahead and siege this town. And we I want to bring up the army. Siege, sire. Well, Roseby's still a bit wounded, but uh I do want to bring up another army to make sure that, that Loras Tyrell's army can't be hit in the back. We'll take the risk and uh, go ahead and just end the turn here. Leaving the army, sire. Yeah, it looks like the Lannister forces are beating back the Tully forces at River Run. Need them to keep distracting Tywin Lannister for a little bit longer. We are the strongest faction. Okay, Rose be in the arbor. Let's get the blacksmith at the arbor. Orders. Yes, my liege. We got some more. Uh, you know, have another unit of Tyrell guards being spawned here, which we almost have enough for another army to be sent out from High Garden. We're still making decent money, which is, I'd like to see that number go up a bit, but as of right now, for the amount of men that we have in the field, it's acceptable. 
Let's go ahead, service. take our merchant. Let's see what resources around here are actually worth anything. Which we may want to send them into the Lannister land because they have gold mines. So there's a silver mine. We'll send him right there. It's going to take him three turns to get there, though. Your Majesty. Continue having this diplomat here. Yes, Move sire. to Dorne. I want to try to Tomorrow's get a royal marriage. Out, sire. Your sire, will, sire, my lord. Orders. Combining forces, sire. I have nothing to say to you. Okay, they sent Jonas Bracken and his army. Seems like they may attack Roseby. Which, if we do, let's start building kind of a crappy garrison here. Going to need some men to hold them back if they do attack Roseby. We'll keep Randall Tarly in King's Landing for now. Come and get me, you coward. I would ask you to find it in your heart. To As you honor. will, my king, to battle. Okay, we're going to have Sir Loras here. Go ahead and attack this city. Going to end this video here and start immediately with the next one. Stay tuned.